it's not the end of the world for Mark Anthony Barriga who lost to Mexico's Carlos Licona via split 12-round decision for the vacant IBF minimum weight title at the Staples Center here Saturday night, yesterday morning, Manila time. Lacona's trainer and former IBF super featherweight champion Robert Garcia described Barriga as a Vakuva fighter and predicted he will become a world title holder sooner or later. Garcia, 43, used to train Filipinos Brian Valoria and Nonito Donair Jr. and has visited Manila. I miss working with Filipino fighters, he said. Barriga put up a tough fight against Carlos. If you ask where he could improve, maybe he should be more aggressive because he's too much of a defensive fighter. Barig is a very skilled fighter, and it's because of his Olympic background. That was a close fight against Carlos, but I thought Carlos fought well to deserve the title. Dot Lacona, 23, came out smoking in the opening round, firing from all cylinders. Barriga, 25, settled down in the second stanza, but it was clear Lacona took charge in the early going. Barriga, a southpaw, Hardly threw combinations in the first few rounds, raking Lacona with his right jab but keeping his left under lock. Then, in the sixth round, Barriga started shaking things up. At the onset, Lacona found it easy to land his long left because Barriga let his right hand dangle down his side. But as Barriga adjusted, things got more and more difficult for Lacona to connect. Barriga displayed the defensive skills that earned him the nickname Pinoy Mayweather. Lacona said there was no doubt he won the fight, but credited Barriga for a courageous effort. He's a great fighter, he said. But I was determined to win. I did it for my parents who sacrificed so much for me. My father sold his truck and my mother, her rings and jewelry, so they could raise money to finance my boxing career, to pay for hotel and training expenses. I finished up to high school in California then I went back to Mexico to pursue my boxing career. I stopped schooling to focus on boxing. Now that I've reached my goal of becoming a world champion, I'm going back to school. I'll continue boxing but eventually, I want to become an x-ray technician. Lacona said his father makes a living by selling furniture while his mother is a housewife. A younger sister Lena, 20, is a pro fighter too, with a 2-0 record. 